What's going on? Welcome back to the channel. Today, we got an electric lunchbox. All right, let's check this thing out. So I picked this up because I did have one of these a few years ago, and after a while, it just it just wasn't working right. It was very cheap. I believe I got it on eBay. It was like seven dollars or something like that. I should have known not to get it, but I did. I tried it. It worked a little bit until it didn't work a lot. So fast forward to right now went on the Amazon and seen it on Amazon it was about 30 something dollars uh, I would believe it was like 38 or 39 dollars then so I go on TikTok got this on the TikTok shop for 24 dollars so I saved saved some money and I had some other stuff that I ordered also but I just threw this in to kind of even out the number that I spent so I'm gonna open this thing up let's show you what's inside 1.8 liter that's a lot that's a lot that equals about 60 ounces or so inside this thing the inside oh yeah I picked up the blue I forgot so just this this thing in a bag we get rid of that here we go got the blue we got the handle on top it's like a rubber handle it slides and you can make it flat see you see the grooves there just when you pick it up that's pretty neat I like how it could go flat you could put some other stuff on top of this if you're keeping this in cooler it doesn't matter you know why because it heats up so I'm seeing here on the top there's two compartments. Let's see. All right. So on one side, we've got a fork. Comes with. It's on the other side. The other side, we got a spoon. It's a nice little spoon. So I'm seeing here we got four locks. One on each side. So let's open this thing up. Looks like we got some plastic here on the inside. Let's pull up the handle. And up we go. Not too much on the lid, just a little compartment where the fork and the spoon is. I was kind of hoping this thing had a knife too, once I seen the fork, but whatever. So inside, I guess you got a little carry bag that this could sit in. I probably won't be using that. We got this plastic tray, that's the cover. And inside the tray is our wires. We'll get to that in a second. There it is. You can see it's that's pretty big. It's pretty deep, you know. You can see that. So let's get this oh, it lifts right out. So it's easy cleaning. That's cool. Get rid of the plastic. So this is our tray. This is what you would put in there. I have seen them where there's dividers in there, but I would prefer it to be just one nice tray. You could put half of something on one side and, you know, just kind of mix up your dish or keep it separated. But I like the idea of having one big tray. On the inside of that thing, you got a warning, a little warning tag, and there's really nothing to it on the inside. So I'm going to put that back in there. And at this point, I'm going to put lid does have a rubber seal around the whole edge see that white does have a rubber seal so you just get that sitting on there and just lock over your lids here is where wire plugs into flip this door down and it's a plug in there with three prongs you see that normally you would see two this one's got three why does it have three? Because we come with two style wires. You have your 12 volt and that two prongs on the end of the wire. 12 volt has two prongs. And it also comes with another wire, regular 110 outlet. 
that also has two prongs. So wait a second. Why does it have three prongs on the plug here? Well, 110 and 12 volt supply a different kind of power. So, in order to make it work, one plug with the two prongs uses one side and the other one uses the other one that doesn't get used. They're all shaped. Both plugs are shaped differently, so it'll only fit in one way. You cannot mess it up even if you rotate the plug. You cannot mess it up because it won't fit. That is a really, really clever design right there. Whoever came up with that. I like that. You cannot be mistaken. If you force it in there, chances are you're going to melt the wire. You're going to fry out the little control board that's in here that tells, oh, it's plugged in. Let's heat the, let's heat it up. So yeah, your 12 volt, your DC 12 volt, and your 110 wall plug-in. So this is also what drawn me to this particular one. The one I had only had the 12 volt plug. And after a while, the reason why it stopped working so much is after a while, the wire itself started getting very, very hot. The plug, not hot. So my food, or whatever I had in there wasn't getting warm. Wasn't even getting warm. But the wire you couldn't touch. No, no, that's it. No more. Get rid of that. We're going to get a new one. Then I found one that I could use the DC 12 volt and the 110. So that sold me. Having one big open tray to have whatever you want in there or fit more of one thing and be able to take it and plug it into an outlet wherever you're staying overnight friend's house relative's house you don't want to bother them plug it in the room and you got some warm food whatever you want in case you don't like what they had now you brought something you know you're gonna like this is the company name i'm not even going to begin to try and say that but there it is electric the lunchbox i can't wait to use this thing so Again, TikTok shop, 22 something dollars, but it's on Amazon. You can find this, these things anywhere. Just do your research, do your reviews. But this one right here, I think I'm gonna enjoy. I'm definitely gonna put it to use. That is for sure. So this thing right here, so I got to show you today. You like this video, hit that like button down below, hit the subscribe and hit that bell. It'll tell you every time we got new stuff posted. Take care.